guys, welcome back to another video. In today's episode, we'll be playing some more Red Dead Redemption. And what we'll be doing is we'll be doing um, our first. Um, our first. Hold on, let's see the name. I think it's our first um, London Ricketts mi mission. And we're just going to call for our horse to go to it. So, yeah, let's just get my horse right here. And I'll see you guys when we make it there. Okay guys, we've made it over to, over to the town where we have to do the mission. It's in Chuparosa. ¿Qué pasó con el otro? Interrumpas, pendejo, la dejé en la casa. Y les digo, de aquí para acá, chingan a su madre. ¿Qué? ¿Y qué no, nos trae ese güey? Y de aquí para acá, pendejos. Hey, gringo! Hablas español? No, sir. Pardon, pero yo hablo un solo poquito español. <laughs> poquito. Habla English? Oh, sí, gringo. Hablo mucho inglés. Sí. Hablo filthy fucking bean eater. Hablo slippery little Mexican. Oh. Hablo little piece of shit. Shit. <laughs> Comprende, amigo? Comprende? Hey, what are you doing here, gringo? I don't remember inviting you to my country. I don't think you did, amigo. I mean you no harm. <laughs> you mean us no harm? This is funny. <laughs> what harm could you do to us exactly? <laughs> Nothing, amigo. Now, I appreciate the welcome committee. But I'd hate to spoil a beautiful afternoon on such beautiful land with any further unpleasantries. Now, if you'll excuse me. Uh, hold it, Gringo. I think you're forgetting something. A little taxation. <laughs> <laughs> I have a large family. Very big. <laughs> I, too, have a family friend. So that we may see our families again, I suggest we part ways amicably. <laughs> can I see the boots, gringo? I think you can see them from where you're standing just fine, senor. Take off the boots, americano. As you wish. <laughs> Very good. Very good indeed, sir. What a great way to improve border relations. An illiterate farmer crossing the river, coming into their civilization and butchering the local peasants. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Don't mention it, old man. You kill peasants, you become a peasant. I never aspired to be anything more. <laughs> A socialist, huh? No wonder you left America. Not many things. Most of them bad. But a man of political principles? No. Well, then I fear Mexico may not be for you, sir. Don't you worry about me. Oh, but I do worry. An angry man a long way from home? A man who handles a gun as sloppy as you? I can handle a gun okay, partner. Yeah, as long as you're killing quail or peasants. But if you have to face another man, you don't stand a chance. And you do? I can show you a few tricks. Come with me. Hold on. What's your name? <laughs> that doesn't matter anymore. And you? I never had a name, mister. I was raised in an orphanage. <laughs> a real American, huh? Wonderful. Just wonderful. Well, you won't make it in the circus, but you can shoot. Keep on practicing. Thank you, old man. Now, who are you? No one interesting. Who are you? 
Landon Ricketts. Not a name that means much anymore. It means a little. You were famous when I was a boy. Yeah, killing men's a strange kind of fame. I was the fastest in my time. I must have been. I'm the only one left. What are you doing here? Living quietly. Waiting. For what? I don't know. And you? I'm looking for a couple of men. Bill Williamson, Javier Escuela. Escuela's <sighs> from here. It could be. This whole place is teeming with a, with Americans on the run. Mercenaries, locals hell-bent on revolution. Revolution? Another one? <sighs> yeah. Never really is. This whole place has been a hotbed for revolution since before the Spanish left. Now there's another local guy running around promising the peasants their freedom. Ah, just like the last two or three. Local government? Foul bunch. Colonel Allende, he runs this place like a feudal king. He's an awful individual. Is that so? Yeah. Until someone puts a bullet in his head. Come on, let's get back to it. You gotta keep that back straight. Otherwise, it makes the gun jump. See if the Schofield makes a difference. Okay, guys, so we have the, um... Schofield revolver. I don't know what you say, it, but we're just gonna enter that eye and shoot these balls. There we are. Now that wasn't so hard, was it? Follow me. We're gonna try something a little more challenging. Yeah, we're just gonna follow Ricketts. The birds right and try and see what we can do here. Um. Scaring the life out of the locals. I say we put your newfound skills Cause this new Scofield revolver, I haven't really used it too much, um. Here we'll do. I'm gonna scare up some birds. Let's see if you can uh, I think it's actually a pretty good um revolver. There's the high powered pistol which I like. So we're just gonna kill two or more beds and dead eye. There we are. Nicely done, sir. You've been taught well. So we're just gonna follow Ricketts into town right here. And see what he's got. I would have thought an old goat like me would have been long forgotten by now. I heard many a story when I was a boy. Still do sometimes. What, these days? I find that hard to believe. What do people say? Oh, you know how them conversations go. Fellers arguing over who's the toughest. Who's the fastest, and who shot people in the back? I place good money on me still being the fastest. Is that so, old man? Aye, Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Por favor, Senor! Our bank wagon's under attack just outside of town. We need your help again. Whoa, slow down, Ramon. We'll take care of it. Thank you, Senor. Again, you are the savior of this town. Well, my friend, are you ready to take a less theoretical exam? Sure. I don't think I ever rode with no savior before. <laughs> Let's haul out. Time we put you to work on some big... Okay, so we're just gonna get on our horse right here. I think we're just gonna follow Ricketts, I'm not too sure. So why are you looking for these two men? It's a long story. We used to ride together. We was all friends once. Only a buzzard feeds on his friends. There must be a high bounty on their heads. What would you do if somebody took the people you love and told you they'd die if you didn't do as they asked? Easy now. Look over there. They're in trouble, all right? Come on. If you don't stop that, you ain't gonna live. They're getting it now, Mark. Okay, so we just killed them all. I'm just gonna keep following him now. Everybody stay alert. It's got the wagon to Chuparosa. We'll just do that. I can see you haven't lost your touch, Landon. Nobody said I had. 
You talk real big for a boy who couldn't shoot straight a half hour ago. And you talk big for an old man who can't stand up straight no more. You're a long way from being a Landon Ricketts partner, young, old, or otherwise. All those stories you heard as a boy were true, you know. That you were eight foot tall with the strength of ten men. Mira, ah. señor! Hay muchos de ellos! That's it. Uh -huh. The um, Scofield revolver is actually pretty powerful, actually. So much for this quiet life of yours, Mr. Ricketts. I didn't say I'd become a coward. I'm not going to stand by and watch good people suffer. They've been beaten down for too long. I give them some hope. They don't know how lucky they are. Damn right they don't, my sarcastic little apprentice. Whoa. Sano y salvo. Nunca podré agradecer lo suficiente. Buy me a whiskey later, and we'll call things about even. Okay, so this is the end of the first video. So, I um, hope you enjoy. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Bye.